Hey everybody, what the heck is going on? My name is Usman and today I'm coming in with the episode number 6 for my Road to Black Ops 3 DLC 3 Gurad Kurovi Zombies and we are literally just 3 plus 1 days, I just wanted to have so many 3's in here but tomorrow I'm gonna be officially able to say we are 3 days away but today, from today, we are officially just 4 days away from the launch of Black Ops 3 DLC 3 Gurad Kurovi Zombies and in this series you guys already know we talk a whole lot of facts, legit information, legal rumors, speculation, ideas, theories, we just talk everything that we know so far about DLC 3 and I haven't done any fun episodes and today is exactly what we're gonna do and today what I have for you guys in the background as you guys can see this is the last mission of World at War uh, campaign and today we're gonna talk about PP, the one and only PPSH, the last scene in World at War, the whole zombies community want this gun to return and we all know it's gonna return in Black Ops 3 zombies, I'm just super excited for it. It, and we all know we got so many new features in Black Ops 3 Zombies. I'm talking about the Pack-a-Punch abilities. I'm talking also about Gobble Gums. I legit got it set up in my mind that I'm gonna be running my PPSH with. But first, let me tell you guys about its stats. Last scene in World at War, it had... Uh, I'm not gonna talk about damage because in multiplayer campaign and Zombies, the damage was really different. And I don't have the real numbers on my screen for Zombies. I have for single player and multiplayer but we're not gonna touch damage because we all know it's a really solid gun but its magazine size was 71 like holy shit it was a tank of a gun like yo it's a freaking LMG in SMG in a form of SMG if you get what I'm saying it has 71 rounds and 213 rounds in reserve for single player 284 rounds for multiplayer and around about the same for zombies I don't have the zombies real numbers up on my screen but it was the same like had th more than 300 ammo and after you pack a bunch like shit go crazy man uh, I'm just I'm just gonna leave you guys with that and the reload time for this gun is 1.83 and it is just so crazy because we all know when we're gonna be able to attach fast mags and if this is in weapon kits I really do hope this is in weapon kits so I can attach the attachments so I can play with the attach attachments if you get what I'm saying and I really do want to play with my PP in other zombies map that would be phenomenal but let's say it is in weapon kits and we have the ability to attach fast mags that's not it though if you can attach the fast mags you already know it's gonna be around 1.5 seconds of reload time instead of 1.83 and uh yo what about speed cola perk when you got that boom like game over it's going to be plain nuts and i'm absolutely high for that it's rate of fire is 896 rounds per minute which is insane and dude what about double tap? Let that sink in. Now you got the PPSH with fast mags and various other attachments. I'm not gonna be like confirming that it's going to be in weapon kits. Let's hope that it's going to be in weapon kits so we can attach the attachments. So we got quick draw and uh, fast mags with our PPSH with laser sight and other attachments. PPSH with attachments, speed cola, double tap, and then you go ahead and pack a punch that bad boy not once, multiple freaking times, and get the freaking blast furnace on and game over like like what is life it's gonna be exactly what up and that is not it though what about gobble gums now if there is another gobble gum that is way superior than what i'm going to say next let me know in the comments below and also let me know what setup you guys are going to run with the ppsh when you finally get the chance to play grad Kurobi with the ppsh now like i told you guys all my setup for the gobble gum that is the last piece and for my gobble gum, I'm gonna run... Reznov, you got this. You, you can make it, my friend. We always survive. Reznov, freaking love you, Mother Russia! This is what up. I freaking love all that war. Like, I freaking... I already have completed the campaign. Okay, why am I talking, like, uh, with that? Okay, let me actually remove that effect. I have finished the whole campaign in veteran difficulty like years ago, like years ago, man. I already have completed it, and my man Reznov freaking love you, but for my gobble gum, I'm talking, I'm saying, all chemical. 
the best, like literally the best. Like there's no other gobble gun that can touch my boy all chemical. Okay, that's not even my boy. But you you get the idea, right? Like all chemical, double tap, uh, speed cola, PPS edge, pack a punch with the blast furnace, attachments, double tap, just whole lot of crazy stuff. It's game over for zombies, and I am just literally super excited for that. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you have enjoyed this fun little video, smash the like button, share with your friends, and subscribe if you're new. And and don't forget to check out other episodes in the series. And yeah, guys, that is really about it.